or for your friends. Okay, we are live, we are live, we are live. Good evening, good evening, good evening, everyone. We are back again. It's Opportunity Chat Show with Brother Neil. We are back again, guys. You know Wednesday uh, belong to Opportunity Chat. I'm here with Tamika Perisin all the way from Hi. USA. How are you? How are you? How are you, Tamika? I'm great. I'm great. I'm ready to chat about the oh, yeah. life. Oh, yeah. I love it. I love the energy. I love the energy. I love the energy. So, guys, uh, I'm just gonna give you two uh, two minutes to share the life, guys. Invite your friends, invite guests, guys. Don't show up alone. You know the procedure. When you are here, you don't show up alone, but you show up with friends. Yeah. So, invite, guys. Invite as much as you can because today is going to be amazing. I am telling you, guys, it's going to be amazing. Uh, I'm with three guests, uh, Tamika from USA, I'm with uh, Sharon Bailo, all the way from Zambia, and also have Coach Slu uh, from South Africa. It's going to be amazing. Let me just do this. Um, let me take them on Facebook so that we can go live with them. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, where is Sharon? Sharon, where are you? Okay, right, 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 guys. Mm. Hey, Mickey, I see you. I see you, Mickey. Uh, Tavo, I see you. Ashley, I see you. Okay, my guest is here. All right, guys. Let the party begin. Let the party begin. Hello, Slu. Yeah, party begin. I'm... Hi, Coach Slu. Slu, can you hear me? How are you doing? Yeah, I can hear you. I'm trying. I'm fine. Yeah. How are you? I'm, I'm good. I'm doing good. How are you? <laughs> Hi, I'm fine, but I'm fine. <laughs> Why not? Hello, it's Coach Tamika. How are you? I'm great. I'm great. Okay, wonderful, I'm guys. Okay as well. Uh, guys, please share the life, guys. As soon as you tune in with us, please share the life, guys. Share the life. Don't show up by yourself. Don't show up alone, guys. Today's going to be amazing. I'm just going to give them a chance to introduce yourself, guys, uh, so that you can hear from them, not from me, guys. I will start with Coach uh, Mick. Tamika, can you please introduce yeah. yourself? Hi, I'm Coach Tamika. Um, everyone knows me as Just Meet Fit Journey on Instagram. Um, I'm World Team. I've been doing this business since I've been using the product since 2016, but I started the business in 2019, right before the pandemic happened. I started the business and I actually came back to um, Herbalife. My story is a little different. So I'm excited. Mm. Thank you, Coach New, for inviting me to, sh um, to share my this opportunity to talk about the business. And share a little about myself. Do you want me to talk about um, share my story next? Oh yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Oh okay. So I was first introduced to Herbalife by my sponsor. I knew him before. I knew him before he was into Herbalife. And when he got into Herbalife, yeah. he invited me to try his shape. So I came, I tried it, and I lost weight. But mentally, I wasn't there. So mm. this is more mental than physical. You get what I'm saying? So you can work out. Um, mentally, you have to be ready to want to change your lifestyle. And mm. something I learned this time around from the first time is that it's not a diet. It's a lifestyle change. Now, you can still do things, but everything is moderation. So I lost the weight. Then I, um, I gained it back. And then I came back. But when I came back in 2000, um, winter of 2019, mm. I came back with a different mindset. I started listening to personal development. I started working on me mentally, physically, spiritually, emotionally, mm. and my life started to change. Um, before Urban Life, I didn't know nothing about personal development. Um, I mm. never listened to um, Jim Rohn. I never listened to Eric Thomas. Um, I never, I just didn't work on myself. And then 
I, I always was one of those people that had New Year's resolutions to lose weight, and then I lose it in January. In February, I'll be back gaining. So now things are different. My lifestyle has changed. Um, I actually didn't wasn't interested in doing a business. I started doing a business because my sponsor, you know, people was asking me, Tamika, you look great, your skin glowing. What are you doing? So I would say Herbal Life, and I would give them my sponsor nutrition club to go. And he said to me, either I can make the money or you can make the money. I still yeah. wasn't listening. So I said, um, finally, I came around and I started doing a business. What really changed my mind is I went to Extravaganza um, summer of 2019, and it lit my fire. I didn't realize Herbal Life was in over 90 different countries. It was over 30,000 people at this extravaganza from all over the world. You have people there from Japan, Jamaica, and it, it lit my fire. So when I came back, I told them, you know what, I'm going to switch over. I was a firm member. I said, I'm going to switch over to distributor and I'm going to start taking the business serious. And I started going to the SDSs, the meetings, plugging in. And I just started inviting people and sharing my journey on Instagram. Um, what really started working for me is during the pandemic, I was showing me at fit camps and people started inboxing me, strangers started inboxing me, asking me, um, you know, about the fit camps. So, you know, once you're on a nutrition, you, the fit camps are free. You're welcome to come because at the end of the day, it's 80% nutrition, 20% exercise. Um, you can exercise all day, but you need the nutrition, the 80% nutrition. And that's what Herbalife offers. Uh, so I started inviting people to fit camps. They started getting on the nutrition. They started getting results. Then people, they were sending me people. And certain people switched over, you know, because I, I said what my coach said to me, my sponsor said to me, either I can make the money or you can make the money. So mm -hmm. my business just started growing. Um, and, you know, it feels good when you get a text message or an email saying, people saying, oh, I'm so happy I met you. You changed, helped change my life. And I'm, you know, health, uh, healthy. And they like the energy at the fit camps. They really attracted to the energy at the fit camps. Um, and, you know, the positivity. And, you know, not everyone is looking to be a part of something. And when they come to Herbal Life, the nutrition club, and the fit camps, they are, they feel, it feels like a family. They're a part of something. A lot of people, you know, don't have family. A lot of people don't have friends. And, then, and a lot of people don't have a person around them that's on the same mission and have the same goal as them. So that's that's one of the um, DMOs I like to use, the fit camps. Mm. Wow, wow, wow. Any awesome questions? stuff. Uh -huh. okay. Wow. Thank you very much, uh, Tamika, for sharing your story, guys. You guys, I hope you are listening, guys. How easy yeah. uh, you can just start this business, guys. How wonderful it is. How, how it's changing our life, guys. Thank you very much, uh, Tamika, for, uh, for sharing uh, your story. Uh, let's just go to our uh, next guest, Coach Lou. Introduce yourself, baby girl. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, good evening. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Tamika is confusing me because I'm looking at her background. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> oh, because the light is light outside. Yeah. <laughs> yes, it's the afternoon here. Yeah, okay. Good evening, everyone. To the viewers at home, you guys know me now, but to our new audience, my name is Silungile Mavundla, 21 years of age, doing her life very, very, very part time, but with zero, I mean, zero excuses, guys. Um, yeah, my background, I found her life in 2019, but I kept on saying, hey, this is not for me. I don't like selling. I don't know how to sell. And then I joined last year during lockdown when I wanted to lose some baby fat. I was fat, 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 fat. And I was depressed. I had a low self-esteem. You know, when you can't wear anything that you like because of your big belly. And yo, my face was just something else. Yo, I was I was I was looking so terrible. I I met her life through a friend of mine. She was also using the product, losing the baby face. I saw her getting some thick. I said, okay, let me just give it a try. Because I was really gaining a lot of weight because of the lockdown, so I was not doing anything. Um, I started using the product, started with RLT and multi fiber and shake as well. And then I got results. I was not even working hard with this gym. I was just going to the gym, doing home workouts whenever I feel like to. 
and I was only working out because I wanted to take pictures after working out. I was not consistent, but my results after 21 days challenge were so amazing, which made me to want to do more, use more products. But money part, business part found me along the way because I was not into selling because I thought I can sell. I thought I knew it all because you know what? I was in college, so I thought I'm very educated. So like I can sell. But yeah, this is just my background. I'm currently a supervisor. I'm working very hard to go to all team like Tamika. I'm coming there. I'm coming to all team. But yeah, this is just... <laughs> wow. Wonderful, wonderful story. Uh, awesome stuff, Coach Slu. Thank you for sharing. Uh, you, we, we use of you, uh, you see, because you are always here on our show. Um, so I just spoke with my other guest. She's coming just now, guys. She she has some uh, network problem. Well, guys, if also I can share my story, guys. Uh, I'm Coach Slu. You guys know me. I'm the host of the show. Uh, I I joined uh, and started Hepa Life 2019, November second. Uh, in three weeks' time, guys, I will be. Two, I think in yeah, two weeks' time I'll be turning two years with Hepa Life, guys. Two years anniversary with Hepa Life, two years of making money, two years of life changing, guys. Hepa Life has changed my life, guys. I started this business, guys, through my sponsor while she uh, when she sold me. It, I think it was a T and a multi fiber, guys. And I was so skeptical about the product, I didn't want to buy because I, I used to I used to be so skeptical skeptical about these products because I used to think uh there's side effects. Well, I didn't know anything about HEPA life guys. I didn't know much about HEPA life. Uh, so I bought because I didn't want to disappoint you. I didn't want to say, no, I can't buy, I can't support your business. I just bought, I just bought because I wanted to support her business. Uh, little did I know that guys, I'm just putting myself into a life changing business. And then she told me, no, I coach, no, you're such a, a wonderful person. You, you like, you're outspoken person. You like people and you are very active on, on on social media so why don't you join the business and start making money i said no i'm not that person i am not a seller because guys i thought the only people who can sell are the poor people little did i know that rich people do you guys still hear me yeah, yeah we can oh wonderful thank you very much so uh i thought guys i was just doing her a favor by joining the business network is really giving him hard times i'm having uh problems okay coach coach sharon is here from zambia hi sharon so guys i'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm 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 experiencing I'm experiencing some network problems on my side. Okay, wonderful. Look like I'm back. So guys, it's been wonderful uh, doing this business. Last year I was on lockdown, guys. Um, my job was closed. I did. I was not working. I was sitting at home. But guess what, guys? I was making money each and every day. The orders were coming in like crazy, guys. Like crazy. As I'm telling you guys, this business changed my life. As I'm speaking to you guys, I am a property owner through the money that I have made in Hepa Life. Currently, I'm on World Team, guys, international world team. So it's wonderful, guys, doing this business. It's very fun. To me, it's like I'm getting paid to have fun because all the things that yeah. I'm doing in this business, guys, I enjoy. Even opening this show, guys, hosting this show, to me, it's fun. Even though it's benefiting yeah. me, guys, but to me, it's fun. So that's my story for me, for my side, guys. As uh, you already heard from Tamika and Slu, we're going to talk about the business, guys. You guys going to know, uh, you guys going to hear from these two uh, powerful dynamics, guys. They're going to tell us, take us through everything about Hepa Life. Maybe I'm going to start from Tami uh, Tamika. Tamika, um, Coach Slu mentioned something about selling. She thought, uh, even myself too, that's what I thought. I thought maybe selling it's for it's for the poor um most of people that i know they have that mindset of that if you are seller you are a seller or you are selling something they have a mindset of that uh, that selling it's for the poor people what can you say uh, uh, about that well okay so selling is not for the poor no matter if you have a job or anything you need more than one income 
Okay, and the pandemic shows us that when jobs were shut down, people were out of work waiting for a stimulus check. So it is very important to have more than one income. Herbalife also offers um, royalties. You can leave this business to your children after you're gone. Um, It's seven different ways you can get paid through promotions, wholesale, retail, um, royalties, and bonuses. So it's 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 a, it's an opportunity, and it also creates um a for you to be your own business. Yeah. For you to be an entrepreneur, work for yourself. It gives you a 1099. You can open nutrition clubs. It opens a doorway for those who don't have a doorway. No matter if you're um lower class, middle class, or upper class. Um, I follow someone on Instagram. Her husband played for I can't remember her name, but her husband played for um the NFL. And she does the urban life business. The urban life business is great for everyone, no matter who you are. Wow, wow. It was wonderful, guys. Mm -hmm. Uh, I hope you guys are listening. I hope you guys are watching. Keep sharing the life, guys. I can see the life is popping. Keep sharing the life, guys. Today, we are here to learn. Today, we are here to gain some uh, hot stuff, guys. Coach Slu, what can you say about people who have a mindset of uh, selling is for the poor? Are you poor because you are selling her by life? <laughs> you can say that I'm not poor. I'm a smile. He says it all. <laughs> uh, selling is not for poor people. Selling yeah. is for people who understand that. I'm, I'm repeating again. I'm quoting from Robert Gostiaki. He said that selling is for people who understand that the economy has moved from its position. <laughs> So yeah. if you can see where you are and always wait for employment so that you can't be rich, they say, if you are employed, you are rich, you are financial stable. That was then back then for our grandmothers and grandfathers. Mm-hmm. But right now, everything requires you to have a second stream of income. Because yeah. the older you get, the more you have needs. Because the more you grow up, pay for medical aid you need to pay for a car and if you calculate from your your salary it's not enough so having a second stream of income helps you to manage yourself even to minimize the stress when you know that i'm getting paid on life, and then month end i'm getting paid mm-hmm. you are able to minimize some stress for yourself yeah. so going on the streets doesn't mean that you you, you are broke you are poor it means that you are limiting the stress you are making your life easier having multiple streams of income as tamika mentioned that on her blood there's a profit which is a result there's a wholesale income they are bonuses that means that you can have three streams of income a month person. so that was then now it's now you need a second stream of income no matter how educated you are so yeah it seems that if brother is back again. Mm-hmm. Okay, uh, I'm sorry about that, guys. I was just fixing my my sound. Uh, it's uh, it's clear now. So, Coach Lou, you, you are you finished? Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Okay. Uh, thank you very much. I, I see we we have uh, Coach Sharon on the call. Coach Sharon, can you hear me? Sh- Sharon. Okay, uh, I think uh, she's having network problems. I, I, I'll go to, uh, I'll go to you, Mick. Mick. So, how, how can you convince someone who thinks uh, maybe he or she can't change uh, his or her life on her life? Because all the stories that we are sharing, they seems like impossible to people. So, how can you like convince or how can you explain to people that how do we make money here in her life? maybe like on your own experience my own experience so um you know a lot of a lot of my distributors under me they started off using the product um so they see that it works and they see how um you know and it comes to the nutrition club so they see the people coming in and out the nutrition club so i kind of let that speak for for itself like to see and i and i've before I sign someone up as a distributor, I invite them to the SCS we have monthly. So they can see 
that is just not me selling herbal life. Because I yeah. I kind of go back to where, where I used to be. I used to be that person. I didn't think herb, you could make money off of herbal life. I didn't even know herbal life worked. I didn't even know herbal life existed at one point. So mm. I put myself in their shoes. So I got to try to think about what convinced me and kind of try to walk mm. them through my experience, my experience and my journey. But I love I love to let them see at the SES that it's different nationalities that um, sell and use Herbalife. That is I like them to see it's over 90 countries. So sometimes I pull up on my phone people doing the business mm. in other countries, other states, and just so they can see the wide range. Mm. Then um, we have Monday meetings. I, I let them join the Monday meetings and hear other people. We have guest speakers. And I let them hear other people speaking and talking about the business and how, you know, their income. So I kind of mm. use my tools around me that Herbal Life provide and let them do the convincing. And then I let people come out and um, to the fit camp and then see, like, it's people right in our same town, our neighborhood. Um, then people that's not in the same state as me, I try to get them on these calls so they get uh, the guest speakers. So basically, just use the tools around you. Let other people help you do your job. Yeah. Like people that's at presidency that's talking at these SDSs, people that's at middle team talking at these SDSs. You start it off and let them close it. Or they do. Or you start it off. They could be in the middle and then I close it. However, it mm. works. But use the tools around you that Herbalife provide. Herbalife provide us with some amazing tools. The to, um. Herbalifebiz.com. So they provide us with amazing tools that we can use to help grow our business. Wow, awesome, awesome stuff. So, Mick, um, what can you say to a person who say, I, I can't join the business because I'm not active, I'm shy, and I'm quiet. So uh, what can you say to that person? They just described me. <laughs> <laughs> they just described me. Um, I used to be, like, shy. Like, I don't want to sell. Like, nobody wants to buy herbal life nobody believes and i know when you just start using products start getting on the yeah. products because when you become passionate about something it speaks for itself and it's, it comes natural it comes easily to you but if you don't use the product it's going to be hard for a person to mm. um talk about it so once you start using the products and you start going through the use wear share then like if you run into someone the first couple of times you're gonna be shy, you're gonna like like why did I say that or I missed saying that. Like even tonight, you're always gonna be nervous. Even tonight, I was nervous. I mean, doing this call, but yeah. when you're passionate about something, is it's just gonna flow naturally. Mm. And you you can also connect with someone who else is someone else who is shy. So it's every, it's someone out there that you can help. That God is gonna cross paths, make you cross paths with them to help. Mm. Wow, awesome stuff. Coach Lou, uh, what, what, what can be your take on that one? Uh, I'm shy, I'm not active, I'm nervous, I can't talk to people, so I can't do the business. I, I guess you know me, brother. You know me more than anyone who's tuning in on this live. You know, mm. you, 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 you know me, you know, you know when, when I joined Harper Life, I was very shy and in such a way that I would attend a boot camp, nobody will notice that I'm there. I, I would <laughs> attend meetings and nobody will I will notice that I'm there. This is <laughs> how shy I used to be. But the love that you get from Help Life people, guys, it's insane. You get the love that you've never received from your family. And then the mm -hmm. person start growing inside you. And you know when you do something that you love, there is something that grows. There's that beast that grows. I never thought I can like talk with people the way I do. Mm -hmm. And my mindset is just amazing. This business can like make you see things that you, you never thought you can. You know, starting to dream big. I was that girl from rural areas. I only knew that I need to go to college. After college, I need to go and look for for job. Mm -hmm. I never I, I thought that people who are rich is because they are lucky, it's because um they inherited mm -hmm. it from their parents and all. But right now I'm building from scratch. I'm building a legacy from scratch. Like this business is just amazing. It makes you see things that you never thought you can. It's because yeah. of the cycle that people that you are surrounded by with they are dreaming. They make you mm -hmm. see the vision and like you you know what there is 
nothing that can stop me. I, it, I can achieve those goals. So if you are shy, don't worry, my love. Don't worry. We're going to mm -hmm. build you. Yeah. You're going to meet amazing people, people who are always happy. You know, on this business, there are times where things are just not happening. But the vibe that you get from Hope Alive, mm -hmm. even the shake itself, you, you know, we, we wake up at 5 a.m. To, to make a detox juice. It's only about the product. It's just amazing. And the passion, you just wake up early in the morning and do it. And not other people, they can think that you're crazy. It's because it's more than the product. We are family. It's not just a life selling shape of selling tea. We are family. It's the love that you get. And they get to change your mindset and see that there is actually nothing that you cannot do. You only need hard work and dedication and your mind is only going to happen. It's only going to open and make you see beyond. Yo, yes. this call is getting more fire. Yeah. Yes, more fire. Yeah. If a person, if you want to grow, something I learned, if you want to grow, you have to get uncomfortable. You have to be uncomfortable. You're not going to grow yeah. in your comfort zone. That's one thing yeah. I learned. Like when I used to go to the SDSs, I used to sit in the back. I would not get up and do nothing. Like when you go to sign mm. books, I wouldn't get up and do anything because I was nervous, shy, and I just wanted to sit there and watch the training. Now I'm on production team. So in order to grow, you have to get uncomfortable. Yeah. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Like Steve Harvey said, you said you gotta be com uh, comfortable with being uncomfortable. Yes. Step out of your comfort zone. Yeah. Because yeah. if you are comfortable, you ne can never be rich. You can never be rich. So, uh, Mick, you, you, you spoke something uh, about, um, when, when you were sharing your story, you spoke something about uh, streamlines of incomes. So, now, I, I have, I've joined Happy Life I'm a member because I've, I've, I've heard people saying there's a lot of streamlines of income. So, how, how can I make money? How can I, I unlock all these... Um, streamlines of incomes and what are those streamlines and what okay. is expected for me as a distributor to reach and or unlock all these uh streamlines okay so for retail um retail is when you're just selling the product um yeah you know i don't know if um i guess it's the same in um where you guys are from but retail so you got the you get you start off when you sign up you start off with 25 percent yeah. It's given to you. And you work your way up to 50%. Now, 50% is the highest you could go in a company, in an um, Herbalife company. I don't know many companies that give people half of the profit for Herbalife do, which is amazing. Then you have wholesale. Wholesale yeah. is when you're signing up members up under you. So you get that in a check um, every month, the wholesale. Yeah. And then the wholesale is your... Um, Distributors under you, your members. Do you have preferred preferred members there? Yeah. Sorry. Do you have preferred members? Where you are? No. All right, it's everyone distributors. Yeah. Oh, okay. So um, the wholesale is signing up preferred members, distributors, and you get that in a check. And when they're signing up people, you also see a percentage of that. So if I'm at fifty percent and my distributor is at twenty five percent. And they make a sale. I see twenty five percent of that. So um, then we're gonna go to um, royalties. That's a separate check, and you get five yeah. percent of supervisors and above, which is a good thing. So all your organization. So um, if they're at supervisor and above, I get five percent of them, and I get five percent of the person under them. And then you see three lines down. So you have me. You have Group one, group two, and group three. So I see five percent. Yeah, the whole organization. So I see five percent. Then we have bonuses. When you get to point certain point in a marketing, you get um two percent bonus if you're at um get team. Then you mill team four percent, and then um president team six percent. So those are four different ways right there. And then you also have vacation that um. Herbal life that you're qualified for promotions, yeah. the Mark Hughes bonus. So it's seven different mm. ways that you could get paid to in this business. And you know, with royalties, you know, you hear about royalties like in the music business, like Michael Jackson left royalties to his kids. Herbal life offered the same thing. Yeah. 
Wow. Thank you very much, Amik. Guys, mm -hmm. you heard it yourself, guys. Maybe you thought uh, every time we, we, we tell you about these three lines of income, we just are uh, like trying to buy your eyes. Someone mm -hmm. from USA just told you guys, I think she counted about eight streamlines of income in yeah. one company. One yeah. company, but eight possible streamlines of income, guys. When you join this business, it's in your hands whether you make yes. money or you don't make money. Yes. If you don't want to make money, mm -hmm. then chill. Yeah. We're going to hustle. We're going to hustle. We're going to push hard. And then let's brown say, you got to be hungry. You got to be yes, hungry. Be hungry. <laughs> yes. Hey, in the business, uh, you know what I like about the Herbalife business? When you sign up, you don't need money to make money. You have a website. They provide a website front for you. You send yeah. people to your website and they order or they can order for you, however you want to work it. But you don't really need money to make money when you first start because people think, oh, I have to invest in all this money. No, just invest in yourself and let you invest in yourself speak help build your business mm. wow this was very wonderful uh coach slow brother we, we we always uh speak about um personal development and people are like maybe they are lost maybe they think it's something it's our language here in help life or something that uh it's required here in help life when we speak about personal development uh, what does it help the help life distributors? How does it benefit me as a distributor? Why do I have to listen to all these people? Why do I have to develop myself? Because selling is just very easy. I just go out there to people. I sell the products. I just go to social media. I use social media. I sell my products. So if selling is so easy, then why do I have to uh, develop myself? Okay. First of all, Selling is not easy. There's no business that is easy. Even like going to school and studying is not easy. I'm not even going to lie to you and say it's easy because you're going to join today and expect to, to be a press team member tomorrow. No, it doesn't mm. work like that. You need to be consistent with whatever you're doing. So basically, brother, anything can happen during the day. You can approach a customer today and then they say, I'm going to buy tomorrow. And then you, you wake up, you're excited. They say that they're going to buy. You even calculate the volume points. It's okay. Maybe this person is buying this and this. I'm going to make 150 volume points. And then they don't yeah. buy. You get disappointed. And then you, you stop looking for customers. So if you listen to self-development every day in the morning, you are preparing your mind. Whatever happens during the day, I'm ready. Whatever disappointments, whatever obstacles, I'm ready to face them and I'm not going to pay attention to negative energy. So you need to feed mm. your mind if you want to be successful because mm. you, are, you, you, you are an entrepreneur. As you are into business, you are an entrepreneur. So as an entrepreneur, whatever that comes out into your mouth, it's all in here, in your mind. So if mm. you listen to music, if you listen to Ikom, you listen to Ama Piano, there is nothing that you you can tell your business partners that can build them. So you need to build yourself internally. You need to feed your mind internally before you even produce weight to build your team. So if you can't build yourself here, you can't build other people. Mm -hmm. So that is why we right. listen to people who feed our mindset people who build us to think big, people who train us to be strong for our team and be strong for ourselves too. Because every business, there are challenges, there are times where things are just not happening. Even not, if it's not happening, even if it's just a store that is selling clothes, there are times where they don't get customers, but they don't close their shops. They keep on selling. It's because they understand that we have seasoned business. So if you are not ready mentally, and emotionally, you're going to say her life is not working. It's because you did not train your mind to be patient. It, Self-development teach you, teaches you to be patient. It teaches you to be disciplined. It makes you to be strong emotionally. So, brother, if you're not strong yourself, you can't build other people. What are you going to tell your members if they feel like quitting, if you are not built here? You can't be a business person or an entrepreneur if you don't know how to build yourself it all starts internally 
and then externally we're gonna see into your face taking this self with the tea that you are happy mm -hmm. that you are active and that you are thinking positive things people are gonna say help life is, is expensive you don't you want to know how you want to know how to reply or to respond to those people if you haven't built yourself here mm -hmm. and saying that the obstacles whatever happens into this business i'm gonna be successful because it's a journey baby steps every day so you need to be patient and you need to be developed here yeah. yo how old are you slow <laughs> yeah, I'm 21. <laughs> How old? 21. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How old are you? 21. 21. 21. <laughs> Impossible. Impossible. Yeah. Never. Do you, do, you, do, you, do you agree with that one, Mick? Yes, I agree. I agree. Look, her personal um development is showing. No, I agree. Great job. You're 21. Cool. Amazing. Yo, I I I can't believe that. Yes, <laughs> you are 21 yet spitting so much fire in your mouth. <laughs> yeah. So, you, you know, brother, it's all about your cycle. If you can check mm. people that I hang around hang around with, mm -hmm. it's not just random people. I can I can't hang around with you if you don't have dreams. If you only think mm. that going to school and going to university is gonna make you successful. If you're still depending on your parents, that is not me. I want to be rich. So I'm surrounded by people who can think big and people who are building, who are making some, doing something in, with their lives. Yes, I'm from rural areas, but I'm going to be the first millionaire in my area. It's because of my circle. So people you hang around with, they are determining your future of, of how, how are you going to be living in five years. So your friends are very important as well. Yo. People from SLU rural area, watch out for SLU. SLU is coming. SLU is on fire. Join, yes. join her. Yes. Either you, you join her or you watch her. <laughs> yes. So, Mick, you, you have something to add on what she just said? No, um, I agree with Sl Coach SLU. Like, mindset is everything. Personal development is everything. That's how you should want to start your day because... Um, you want to start your day on a positive note so the rest of your day can go positive. So that's very important. And also, listen to personal development just help you change some of those bad habits you might um, have. And then open your mindset to a whole nother world that you didn't even know existed. Mm, yeah. Mm, mm. Wow, it's powerful. I think I can relate to what you're just saying. You know, sometimes I just feel like I'm, I'm in my own world the, 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 the yeah. way I sometimes like sit, uh, sit alone like chill, chill alone and think of a lot of things. And then I begin to see, you know, what? it's like I'm on, I'm in my own world because yeah. these things that I'm thinking, I don't think they just exist. They be, they beyond a uh, human yeah. um, being. So guys, as I have a distributor now, like maybe I, I can go to you, Mick, first. Do, mm -hmm. Have you ever go through a, uh, to a season where your, 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 your season was just dry. You couldn't dry. get customers. You couldn't get customers. Yes, uh, um, no one was joining. The business was like slow, 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 slow. Have you ever gone through to that season? Yes, I have. Actually, when I first started, when, um, as I mentioned, I went to Extravagance in 2019. Uh, and that's when I decided to, um, you know, take the business seriously, get into the business. So that fall of 2019, I started getting serious, but I cannot move from senior consultant. Mm. Um, I started moving in January of 2020, January, February of 2020, I started moving. Mm. And then when the pandemic hit, it really just skyrocketed. Um, everyone's, uh, I started doing things different. Let's just say this. Um, I started working on me. Um, People want to see results. I started sharing my journey. So I started posting more on social media. Also, I was more consistent. Before I wasn't consistent. And I really started changing my lifestyle. Mm. So that helps. Um, and I would start talking to more people and inviting. You have to invite people. Um, and that just started changing for me. It just started changing for me. Mm. But it was dry. When I first started, it was really dry. Like... It was really dry, but now um, things are getting better. But you, you know, some months are better. Um, 
some months are better than other months, but I just keep going. I don't let that discourage me. And when people say no, my spots always tell me when people say no to the product, I mean, when people say no to you, they're not saying no to you. They're saying no to the product. Yeah. So you can't let that discourage. A lot of people get discouraged when it's dry and when people keep saying no or when people fall off, people get discouraged and want to stop the business. No, you keep going. Because not just with Herbalife, any business have dry points. You you know, like my my sister and my brother has a restaurant and it gets it gets dry sometimes, but they can't just stop and close the restaurant. They have yeah. to keep going. That's why you have to Mark Hughes said, um, you know, you have to save your checks and stuff. For those dry months. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So you just gotta keep going. Push through those dry moments. Just keep working on yourself and keep getting your results. Keep doing your personal development and keep inviting. Because people Mm -hmm. need um, the lifestyle change. People want to get healthy. People just don't know where to start. And believe it or not, when you post on social media or at Facebook or even your everyday life with people around you, they're watching you. They might not be ready mentally, but when they're ready, they're going to reach out to you. So just keep mm. on going. Keep on going. Wow. People are watching you guys. Whatever that you yes, are doing. Yes, people are watching. Yes. People so that, are yeah, watching. Whatever you're doing. Mm-hmm. Mm, mm. So when you give up, you're not killing only yourself, but you're killing everyone yeah. that is watching yeah. you. So you gotta watch out because people are watching. You gotta be, you gotta be persistent in whatever you're doing. Mm-hmm. Be consistent. There's something that uh, uh, Coach Lou mentioned earlier. Uh, she said she realized that uh, money, the rich people, they are not rich because they are lucky. But they they were sell they were selling they were working hard for them and then yes. to me it came out the the, the the scripture in the Bible I think it's Ecclesiastes chapter eleven verse nine it says the race is not for the swift and 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 is and, and also it says the race is not for the swift and 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 the bread for the for the wise and yeah but it, say, it talks about something like that and then in the end it says but the chance and the opportunity comes to everyone. So this one means to all the people who are rich, they are not rich because they are lucky. They are rich because they worked. They are rich because they discovered their purpose, their vision. They are, they worked hard for, for, for what they have. So yeah. they had a chance, they have an opportunity, and then they had time. So guys, this is a similar gift. Everyone has the very same gift. You have time, you have opportunity. Opportunities come to everyone. Chances come to everyone. But it depends on you, guys, because there is power in making decisions. So it's either you decide or you be aside. People have decided they are pushing in life and they are going far. And some have reached far. So it's up to you, guys. you got to make a decision because even this church, guys, even this show, guys, it's all about opportunity. We yes. are sharing the business opportunity opportunity to you guys. I'm calling people from Zambia. I'm calling people from South Africa. I'm calling people from USA. I'm calling people from all over the world just to share the business opportunities, guys. Not for only to, not for you guys to only join my team, but to join Help Alive because here in Help Alive, everyone you can go wherever, guys, wherever they will tell you one thing: we change people's life. Yes. So. That's our target, guys. That's our target. We change people's life. Whether you join under me, whether you join under me, whether you join under Slu, whether you join, as long as you are joined, as long as you take the opportunity, guys, and use it, because we want to see your life changing. That's what you want to see. That's why we are here, guys. So, Coach Slu, when when things are dry, when you feel like giving up, what is what push that pushes you to move on? To push on or, or, or keep on grinding? It's my why, brother. My why is so strong in such a way that even talking about it right now, it, it, it's just it's just too much. So whenever I... I <laughs> yeah, it's just because I, I'm thinking about it. It's because whenever I think of my why, I cry. Hi, brother. So right now you're putting me into that position, but it's fine. I'm a big girl now. <laughs> if you don't have a purpose of doing something, that thing won't work out for you. If yeah. you don't know why you're doing something, it won't work out. So Eric Thomas says that 
think about four people that, that you are doing it for. Then you're going to keep on going. You know me, brother. When things are not going, I even come to you and say, it's not happening. And then I go back to the basics of using the product, talking to people, and be branded. If that is not working, I need to try out new things. You know what I like about um, technology? It allows you to try so many things when you are doing a, a network marketing business. You can advertise and pay for your page and reach out 2,000 people a day. There's a lot that you can do. So when things are not working, I sit down and re-strategize. I won't, I'm, I won't lie, you know I'm very honest when I'm talking about business because I want people to learn from me. This month, mm. I've received only one order this month. Mm. Things are just hectic. You know what I'm doing right now? I'm building my diamonds. I want them to sound like me. I want them to, to, to sound like me, walk like, like I want them to be me. So if things mm. are not happening, build, build your members, build yourself. Hard work and dedication, brother. You see, right now, when I wake up in the morning, I have that in mind. Hard work and dedication. Hard work and dedication. Say that when, wherever you're going, hard work and dedication. That is how you're going to be brave enough to tell people about the product, to tell people about the business. Go out there and search for people. If things are not going, go and look for fresh fresh blood. We need fresh blood. We need people who, who don't know about this thing. We need people who are fired up. So if you're going to limit yourself, if you're going to limit your audience, it's not going to work out. I was in Gateway yeah. on, or oh, I was in Pavilion at the mall on Sunday, on, on Saturday. It was raining. I had a choice of saying I'm not going because it's raining. Mm -hmm. But I remember that I'm, I'm not going to melt. I'm not going to melt by going there. So I went there and came back with fresh blood. On, Saturday, on, Saturday, on Monday, I went into Gateway, another mall, all by myself. First of all, mm -hmm. I'm not used to Gateway, so I went alone. I was going there to search for fresh blood. If the blood that I have on my WhatsApp, on my Facebook, on Instagram is cold, I need to go and, and look for fresh blood. People were excited. And I went there, mm -hmm. I collected numbers with zero excuses. I'm showing my members that mm -hmm. I can do it alone. I can do it tired. I can just do it anytime. So I was saying that yeah. in mind, working for the mall, hard work plus dedication, hard work plus dedication. If you don't put in the work and you're going to mm -hmm. keep on saying it's not happening, it's not going to happen. If what you're doing right now is not working, look for other things that's going to work for you and stick on it. And always try out new things because customers, they want new things. You can't be advertising um, one thing, one you you can't be using one, one advert on television, on and radio. People are going to get bored. They need, need something that is new, which means that it's going out there creating the content for yourself, mm -hmm. which means that you need to ha have new results, something that's going to make your customers say, wow, mm, brother, you have six pack now. Wow, next yeah. month wants to skin glowing. So yeah. you need to keep on entertaining your audience if you're gonna stick on one thing and say that my business is dry what are you doing yourself if your members are not working what are you doing as a sponsor go out there and search for new blood things are gonna happen don't expect to plant seed today and harvest mm. tomorrow you plant you water your seeds you harvest plant water them harvest it's a journey and dry seasons are training you for your next pin if you can't tolerate dry seasons now that means you're not ready to go to press team because it's hot at out out there up there press team it's hot but here are you only getting started be in control of your emotions if it's not working don't mix your emotions in business be excited even if things are not exciting slow <laughs> i'm done <laughs> yes new blood yes the 25 oh. mindset yeah okay i i i think it was my side i thought it's your it's you it's your side guys because uh there was a network uh problem so wow coach slew that was very powerful that yes, was very very powerful, very powerful. Yeah. i i like the way you, you started it when you're saying uh what pushes you is your why even if you like mm -hmm. to give up but you've got a why jim ron yeah. says if your why is strong, your how is going to be easy. Guys, when you speak about the why, we are speaking 
of something that pushes you. You want to give up, but you got to why. Why not? Why not? Am I, like me, guys, I have three kids. Those three kids are my why. Why am I pushing so hard? Why am I so busy? Why am I doing all these things? Why am I selling? Why am I, why am I passionate about selling the products of Herbalife? It's because I have why. My why is my family, guys. My why, my biggest why is my mother, guys. My, my, my mother's biggest dream, guys, is only one, to live in a big, beautiful house. So I got I to gotta make sure she don't die before living in that house, guys. So I got to make sure that is one of my why. I'm just giving you, like, a, examples because some of the people, like, they get lost. What you, what, what you mean when you're talking about why? So I'm just making things easier for you guys because each and every one of you guys has their own why. If you are studying hard, it's because you got your own why, why, why you are studying. That's why Jim Ron says, if your why is strong, then your how is going to be easy. Because if you got to push, if you got something behind you coming from um, maybe uh, an, an unfortunate uh, background, that mm -hmm. means how are you going to change your situation? How are you going to change your situation? It's going to be easier because your why is strong, you see? So guys, this is a very, very powerful uh, meeting. It's a very powerful call, guys. I'm enjoying it. I am fired yeah. up, guys. These two dynamics are putting fire on me. These two dynamics are <laughs> fueling me, guys. After this yeah. call, I'm telling guys, I'm going to be firing on selling the products. I'm going to be firing on introducing yes. uh, new people into the business. So, Mick, there are these two pieces that uh, they just want to sell the product. They don't want to use the product. What can what advice can you give those? Because I know I always follow each and every day. I wake up in the morning, even though our times time zone clashes, but I always wake up in the morning. The very first thing when when I when I look into my Instagram. I go to your stories, the way you use the product. Yeah. Like in your tea, I always look at your tea. You <laughs> add five things on one tea. You add a tea, you add a, a proco, and then those three other stuff that I don't know because you don't have here in South Africa. The way oh. you use the product. Yo, yes. So what, what advice can you give a distributor that wants to sell? He or she is selling, but not is not into the product is not using the product what can oh. what advice can you give to that person well the advice i give you're not gonna be able you're not gonna go far because you have to be a product of the product and mm. it comes it helps when you're on the product and you're using the product it's, it's come more natural when you're explaining the products you know how the product works because some, mm. you can't explain something that you're not using you don't even know how to make your body feel you don't know how to make you work because if someone asks you what does a banana like what does a um a certain shape taste like how can you describe it like a praline and cream how can you describe something if you're not using it um mm. if someone asks you how do an energy product like the energy do it make you feel jittery how what are you going to go off of what i'm selling you you have to try these products and, and see how it works for yourself and yeah you have to use wear and share mm. to be successful in this business wow this was powerful i think the, yeah. the most powerful part is that uh, when you use the product you get to know because yes. you can know the products because it's very fall. hard to explain you, something that we've yeah. had and you yeah, fall in love so. with the products like you fall in love with the products like every morning i have to have my tea like my best defense my aloe that's how i start my day that gives me the mm. energy i need energy um, yes <laughs> i love it i love it yes i love it but i just tell like you know um I've, I've come across um people on my team that some don't use the product but they you know they sell it like they you know and they actually do sell the products without kind of using it but you know it kind of stopped like um his business kind of stopped because you know people want to see you using the product they don't want to yeah. just see you post the pictures and post the other people using the products and other people results. They want to see you use the product. They want to see the products in your home. Mm, mm, so, mm, mm. you know, not even just going to the um, nutrition club game. They, people want to see you have the products in your home because we're telling you it works. We're telling yeah. you um, put it in your home. You need the 80% nutrition. So yeah. I can't <clears throat> tell you something that I'm not doing. Mm, mm, like... Mm. I, you got to kind of practice what you're preaching. And like, if I'm telling you uh, something worse and I'm telling you, oh, you need this, how, how can I tell you that? 
Mm-hmm. How can I tell you to buy mm-hmm. something I'm not even buying? Sure. I'm not even using. You know, and then that's where um, if people want to be able to trust you, you know, people want to make sure you're not trying to scam them. I'm sorry. Yeah. People want to make sure you're not trying to scam them. They they want trust. You need to build those relationships. So when you want to be honest, you want to be real, and people can see through fake, see when you're not using something. Because when they go and look at your social media or when they see you, you never have a Herbalife product in your hand. You're never using a Herbalife product. Mm. Wow. That was wonderful, guys. How can you sell something that you're not sure of? How can you sell something that you're not mm-hmm. using? How can people buy from you when they don't see you using the product? So you are mm-hmm. making people more skeptical, guys. Coach Lou, what can be your take on this one? Guys, uh, you know I'm able to have this repeat, so you can see, guys, the product is always here, guys. The <laughs> product is always here. Product is yeah. always here, guys. We use the product. We don't use the product. We abuse the product. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we abuse the product. Coach Lou, what can be your take on this one? Um, First of all, but, brother, people buy you. They don't buy the product. They buy mm. you yeah. as a distributor. And in this business, yeah. before you even go out there and look for customers, you need to be your first customer. You need mm. to be the one who buys in his or her shop first before you go and look for other people. So, you know, I, I like to make examples with things that we all know. You can't sell a chicken and advertise a chicken, but you've never tasted yeah. it. You don't know whether it's really, it's gonna kill people yeah. or it's not gonna kill people. You need to taste mm. it and feel the taste and then tell the next person. If you don't yeah. know the energy from the tea, what are you going to tell to people? Are you gonna tell mm-hmm. them this is gonna have energy, but you don't have the energy yourself? So it doesn't mm-hmm. work like that. There are so many happy life distributors. You all wake up in the morning, you are having tea, but we need to fall in love with you we have different smiles mm-hmm. when you, you're having the tea other people they change their distributors and go and buy to someone else it's because of the energy that they're giving so mm-hmm. if you don't want to use the product you don't have the business you're selling lies so you're just selling lies to people be your mm-hmm. first customer and make sure that you have the product even if the i know that to be honest we have students who are doing the business and they say it's very hard to purchase the product at least have one product that you can show to people that it's working as for myself before using gains i didn't know how to coach somebody who's using gains then i started using gains that then i knew how to coach the next person so if mm-hmm. you're not using the product you, you, you you're mm-hmm. not doing business because you need to be your first customer and make sure that you add the product of the product yeah wow that was wonderful guys that was wonderful yeah. i can see here even on facebook people are firing people are firing uh thank you coach bongega coach uh slu coach mbo sp uh who else is thank you guys for sharing the page thank you thank you very much and for everyone who's tuning in guys uh, you guys are on fire. We are learning. Learn from your peers. Thank you very much for those who are watching uh, us on Facebook. Guys, we are here with Coach Slu and Tamika, guys. It's going yes. down. It's going down. Unfortunately, yes. guys, we have reached uh, the time where we have to say goodbye. But I can't say goodbye, guys, without them uh, talking to us for the last time, maybe uh, dropping the last nuggets, dropping the okay. last nuggets for us, guys. <laughs> so, uh, Tamika, now it's, uh, this, uh, this side is 9 o'clock and, 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 and the call is only one hour. But guys, because I can see people are firing, people are, like, are liking you guys, uh, I'm going to call you guys next time. You, need, you guys need to come back. I feel like you're not finished, guys. There are still a lot of stuff you need to drop for us, guys, because I, I'm, I am activated, guys. You know, I am revived. My business yeah. is, has, has been revived, guys, by you. You are so powerful, guys. You are very, very powerful. So, Tamika, before we close the call, maybe um, what message you, you would like to leave uh, for us? Yes. Um, well, first, nice meeting you, Coach Slu. Thank you, Coach Nu, for having me. Um, remember, no nutrition, no results. That's one. Hmm. Two. And for um, people that's doing the business, your next pin is in your new result. Hmm. So your new result, that's your next pin. Because the people that's already following us, they already know what we could do. They already can see what we could do. 
We need to grab yeah. new people. So our new result will grab some new people. Yo, yes. no nutrition, no result. No result. The next team is on your new result. <laughs> Yes. Guys, yes. did you hear that one, guys? Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> guys, I am fired up. I am fired up, guys. No nutrition, yes. no results. No results. No result. Then your next spin yes. is on a new result. Thank you very much, yes. Tommy. This is very, yes. very Thank powerful. Thank you for having Coach me. Yes. Coach yo, Snow, what can you say to us? Tamika, I'm so touched. My next pain is on my results i'm so just so touched i need yeah. to work more on myself i need the <laughs> debt oh my god yeah. um first of all one thing that i can say is that i think i've said it before there is nothing that you cannot be you are a better person today but if you can know that your future is in your hands your person that you want to be is in your hands you can go yeah. very far if God gave you a brain, if God gave you eyes and hands and legs, use it to become the best version of yourself. And what I like about business, we don't look at your background. I don't care where do you come from. What I care about is where do you see yourself in five years. And if you are a helpless distributor and you feel like nothing is happening, one thing I can tell you is that people you started with at 25%, it's rare to go to press team with them. So go out there and look for fresh blood so that you won't say that her life didn't work for you. How much work do you put in every day? And most of all, choose people you hang around with because they are, de they are determining your growth into your business. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. And then you say, guys, this person is 21 years yet. Yeah. She's dropping so much fire. So slow. Yeah. You yeah. guys, yeah, yeah. I, 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 if, yeah. uh, if, if, it, if it was for me, guys, I was just gonna say, let's us carry on, but because of time, guys, uh, we're just gonna come back next week, guys. So stay tuned, guys. Every Wednesday, eight o'clock, uh, eight, eight p.m. We are here, guys. You all know that Wednesday afternoon, guys, belong to opportunity chats, guys, where you don't show up by yourself, you don't show up alone, but you bring a guest guys you all we must always bring a guest if you have brought a guest and guys you want to join the business go to a person who invited you to this call you want you are interested guys to, to to do this business because you you were motivated and inspired uh inspired by our guest go to a person who invited you to this call guys and then join immediately guys remember this you don't need to be great to start but you need to start to be great, be great. thank you very much guys to everyone who's watching the call if you are from south africa zambia africa good night and if you are from yeah. usa good day I I love you, guys. Good night. bye, bye. 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 <laughs>